Hello there. You must be Neil TV8, right? Welcome to Duda Airstrip. I'm Arturo, the owner of this aero club. Here at the club, we provide all the training lessons you need to get started and earn your private pilot license. Then, once you've earned your PPL, you can build up your flight hours and get more experience by taking people out on first flights. But before any of that, let's head outside and take a flight to get familiar with our aircraft and the local surroundings. Welcome to the apron. This is where all our flying adventures begin. Why don't you walk around a bit while I finish the pre-flight preparations? Today we will be flying in a Cessna 172 Skyhawk. It's the main trainer airplane in our flight school. Our Cessna's got a glass cockpit and a 180 horsepower engine, climbs well, and is easy to fly. It's one sweet ride. I'm ready if you are. So hop in and buckle up. Let the good times roll. Welcome aboard. While you settle in, let's go over our flight plan. After taking off, we will climb to 1,500 feet above sea level, and then fly over the airport to enjoy the view. Ready? Why don't you start the engine for us? Perfect. The wind is from 270 degrees direction with a speed of 9 knots, so we'll be taking off from runway 01. Okay. Let me taxi to the runway. comes the fun part. After releasing the brakes and applying full power, we will speed up and take off once we reach 60 knots airspeed. We will be climbing at 75 knots, which is the recommended climbing speed for the Cessna Skyhawk. While climbing, we will follow a left-hand traffic pattern and make two turns. Don't worry if it sounds overwhelming. I am here to help. Release the parking brakes, otherwise we're not going anywhere. Good. Ready for takeoff. Apply full power to get us moving. You handle the yoke, and I'll take care of the pedals, steering the aircraft on the runway during takeoff. We have reached 55 knots. Pull the yoke a little bit to lift off. We are approaching our first turn. As you'll see, the Cessna 172 requires very little yoke movement to turn. start turning left. We are 300 feet above the ground. I will retract the flaps. You keep climbing. Keep climbing and prepare for the next turn. This is a good climbing angle. Try to visually remember it. Okay, turn left again. We are almost there. Remember, we need to climb to 1,500 feet. 
It will keep us 500 feet above the traffic pattern. feet above sea level and 500 feet above the traffic pattern. We have safe separation with the other airplanes. Look around. See our airport? Let's fly over it. I'm glad that we flew together today. This might be the first chapter in your pilot's journey. If you want to embark on it, let's catch up at our headquarters. You seem comfortable out there. I'm sure you will get your PPL in no time. There's a laptop in the office that shows all the certification information you'll need for your PPL exam. Take a look. Here you can see all the different certifications you can pass throughout your career. Your first step is to work towards your private pilot license. 